this because you're going to talk first. Okay. I don't want to talk first. This is your topic. No? Yeah. Hey, Gymnanigans. So today we're going to be talking about side stitching and or side cramping. So Melissa and I were talking about this when we start warming up. Sometimes you get some cramps going on in that liver or upper torso, torso area. So she's got a couple insights when it comes to nutrition and hydration. Like, um, what? Stay hydrated. It's pretty simple. Electrolyte pills as well, especially if it's warm and depending on the climate that you're training in. Yeah, so always have a water bottle on you and try to hydrate before. Protein shakes always help as well. And if you're in the process of running um, and it's happening, so I've been able to come up with a really cool, um, I don't know, like a hack. What would you call it? I don't know. <laughs> sure, a hack sounds good. Yeah. Um, as you're running, I like to exhale and flex the upper torso and then take really short breaths and keeping the air out. And so as I'm running, I'm keeping that flex constant and usually takes about 30 seconds or so before it goes away. And then it really, I, I've never had it come back, but it's worked for me. And if you can add those two things together, hopefully you guys won't cramp because cramping sucks. Do you do any breathing and like counting when you're doing that? That's a good question. No, um, I try to take short breaths in. So my body's being oxygenated and then I'm just constantly flexing and breathing out. And so short breath, like how many seconds? So probably five to 10 seconds. Yeah, that's a good question. Yeah. Each breath is five to 10 seconds? So a breath in would probably be like one or two, and then I would try to exhale and keep it slow. So it's a constant exhale. Does that make sense? Okay. Yeah. So it's like a one count in and like a four count out? Yeah, that sounds about right. Okay. Yeah, and that's a big help. So breath work. Breath work. Tell us some more about breath work. I use breath work in everything. I learned breath work doing yoga P90X a very long time ago. But what I found is that it correlates to every single movement that I do. So if I am weight training, I use breath work for that. I have learned when to breathe so it optimizes my efforts. Um, same thing with the circuit training and the HIIT training that we do, um, especially with the sauna and the ice bathing. Um, there's so much you can accomplish if you can just learn to control your breathing. I like it. Thanks for the input. Thank you. And thank you. <laughs> Perfect, thanks. Yay! I feel like I asked you a million questions. 